guys welcome to my channel so this is my first video and for this video i'm going to be making a pharmacy using the first house that you get in the house designer in toko life so first off i'm starting by making the bathroom that they usually have in the pharmacies comment down below if you want them to make a real pharmacy in toko life world I don't understand how people can watch videos like this with no commentary on it. Like whenever I'm watching them, I'm always like, oh, wow, this is really boring. <laughs> like, I don't know. I just, I can't sit down and watch something with no, like, voice, like talking in it. I have no clue why. So yeah, this is going to be really great build. I actually really enjoyed making this and mm -hmm. i had to make this and edit this like kind of last minute though because of i um made a video that was a story time so there would have been multiple parts to it and then i accidentally reset the world so everything was gone and i was way too lazy to um you know put everything back so i just decided to make a new video in this just popped in my head. I haven't really seen anyone do this, so I don't know. I thought it would be interesting. So, these cup things that I'm getting, I know it's in them, I just don't want to see it. Let's just pretend that they are empty because that's going to be very, very awkward to have them just hanging around in the bathroom. <laughs> so, yeah. So right now I have started making the front desk like where you'd like pick up your medication. So yeah. I had to have a like there was an online presentation kind of thing of someone talking about online safety, which is like the seventh one that we've had this year, which is very boring and it was online. And he was talking about how things like apps can trace you. He's like, so I'd support you if you deleted all your social media. I'm like, almost everything can track you. The only way to get rid of it is to delete your entire thing and it still have all your information. Just getting rid of a couple apps is not gonna do anything. I do a bit, but not that much. And I like them too much. This took so hard and long to find, like all this stuff. I don't know why, it just did. So, yeah. Like I was talking about before, the story, there will be a story coming. It's just I haven't edited it yet. I've made it, but I recorded it, I just haven't edited it. Edited is such a weird thing to say, I don't know why. I just realized that I have had no excitement in my voice and I'm probably boring you guys to death. But let's hope not. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna go to the next thing that I was talking about. Well, that I was going to say. Whatever. So, I had like a concept or whatever that I was thinking about. It's, it's kind of weird and everyone calls me crazy for it, but I was like, what if it actually would like to happen in the future? I'll just say it. What if like, if you know like vegetables and like um, fruits that grow on trees and like in the ground? Yeah, them? What if they grew inside you? Because one, then you never have to eat them again if you didn't like them. And two, you wouldn't really have to eat that much and you wouldn't always be hungry because you can kind of just like, I don't know. Yeah, wait, pause for one second. I realized that these are like all the colors in the rainbow, so I made a rainbow. Please don't ask me why, I was really bored. So whatever. Um, And then like babies and stuff that like grow in your stomach grew like on trees and like in the ground. Because then like you could just... So this, this is halfway finished. Man, I need to get to one point and talk about it. So now I am making the waiting room, like where you wait for like, your number to call or to get your like vaccine or whatever. So, as I was saying, what if like babies and stuff grew on trees and in the ground? Cause then like you could just like go and like just pick one up. Like, yeah. Wouldn't that be fun? Just to go into like a pumpkin patch, just pick out a baby. I think that would be fun. Mm -hmm. 
I'm also not the brightest person ever. Like, I'm book smart. I'm just not smart smart. So I was thinking, and I didn't realize until I actually said it out loud to my friend. She started laughing at me. But, um, I was thinking about what my hairline would look like if I didn't have any hair. Yeah, like I said, not the smartest person ever. But it's fine. Doesn't matter. I'm really bored. There's this problem I have with, um, the, like, new, like, there's the closet kind of thing, and then the dresser in, sorry, so now I'm making it the place where, like, you put the vaccines and stuff, and you give the shots. Okay, so, I always have a problem with, with, like, the closet and dresser and stuff with the new modern mansion, and my clothes never, like, goes into it. If you've had the same problem and know how to fix it, please tell me, because it's really annoying. Okay. Back to the video. This was actually so fun to make, though. If you want a pharmacy, I'd suggest making one yourself because it's actually really fun. And you can use my design or someone else's. Or your own. So, we're coming to the, almost the very end where you'll see the finished project. Here you go. Product. Yeah. Oops. Thank you for watching, subscribe, like, comment, I don't know. Thank you, bye.